You ever heard of the ICC? This is an interesting story. So the ICC is the International Criminal Court. Most people have no idea what it is. It's in The Hague, which is the capital of the Netherlands. Most people don't know that. Okay. So the ICC has 123 member countries, not the United States. We have not signed on to that, nor has China, India, or Russia. <clears throat> We're not part of it. Those 123 countries send money to the ICC so they can investigate war crimes, crimes against humanity. That's what it's in business to do. You with me so far? Okay. So the ICC has issued arrest warrants for Bibi Netanyahu, the leader of Israel, and the Hamas leaders, and also the defense minister of Israel. These are warrants issued by The Hague in Netherlands. Now, there's no way these warrants are going to be served. If you tried to serve these warrants on Hamas, they'd shoot you in the head, all right, or torture you before they shot you in the head. So those aren't going to be served. And Netanyahu's yeah, security never going to let these people close. Now, you may remember the only real headline grabber was that the ICC prosecuted a man named Ratko Mladic, former Serbian uh, leader for war crimes, and convicted him. And he's in prison serving life. He's 82 years old. That was the big one. You remember the Balkans war in the 90s? Okay, he grabbed this guy, this Serb. They whisked him over to Holland, which is the Netherlands. And they convicted him. That, that was their big gun. But now they have issued arrest warrants for Netanyahu and the Hamas guys. They also issued arrest warrants for Putin and his crew about two years ago. <laughs> of course, you know, Putin. Again, you try to serve a warrant in Russia on Putin, not going to work out. Okay. Now, in... There's a reason I'm telling you all this. So here's Biden's statement about the ICC. Let me be clear, whatever this prosecutor might imply, there's no equivalence done between Israel and Hamas. We will always stand with Israel against threats to its security. That was written for Biden. Okay. Here's Netanyahu's statement. With what audacity do you compare between the Hamas that murdered, burned, butchered, raped, and kidnapped our brothers and sisters and the IDF soldiers who are fighting a just war that is unparalleled and morality that is unmatched? OK, OK, so this is political. Much of the world hates Israel, as you know, far more countries hate Israel than like Israel. Um, but it's not going to lead to anything. Everything is expensive these days. You know that the government is printing trillions of dollars in consumer prices higher than ever. If the government continues its printing and spending, the dollar could continue its free fall and lose its coveted role as the world reserve currency. Let's hope that doesn't happen. But there are a few things you can do right now. American Hartford Gold can show you how to protect your money, your retirement, your hard earned savings against inflation by helping you diversify a portion of your portfolio into physical gold and silver. Start with a short phone call. And they can have physical gold and silver delivered right to your door or put inside your 401k or IRA. So please call or text them right now. Tell them Bill O'Reilly sent you. Call 877-444-GOLD, 877-444-GOLD, or text GOLD to 65532. Again, that's 877-444-GOLD, or text GOLD to 65532. Thank you for watching the No Spin News. To watch the full episode anytime on BillOReilly.com, please sign up to become a premium or concierge member. Visit BillOReilly.com to sign up and start watching today.